So one of the reasons why you're still weak might be because you are listening to your feelings too much, you know, because your feelings tell you that it's hard, it's, it feels better just to uh, stay in a safe, bib safe bubble and it feels better just uh, to not speak to that girl and just to stay at home because you don't feel like going to the gym. That's basically the reason why so many people are weak because they listen to their feelings. That's a woman's thing, you know, to listen to their feelings, not a man's thing. So you should actually know in your subconscious mind which is actually better for you. So stop listening to your feelings all the time. So yeah, so how to stop being weak? You know, I've got a few good tips. So one great way to stop being weak is to challenge yourself and actually see life as a game. So every time you run into something that is hard, you see it as a game and you challenge yourself. Like challenge yourself to do that hard thing. So for example, you see a beautiful woman, you know, in the corner of the gym and you, you think, well, I actually want to go speak to her, but I'm a little scared. Just challenge yourself to do it, you know, challenge yourself to actually go speak to her. And if you actually overcome this challenge, you actually get some sort of reward. So not only you might get a number or anything like this, but you will also get a internal reward because you know you have been successful. For example, another example, you know, you want to start a business, but you, you know, you can, you can stay in the corner like a petty little weakling, you know, listening to their feelings because you, you don't feel like starting a business or you can actually challenge yourself like, okay, I am going to start a business. I'm going to, this, the next two years, I'm going to do everything I can to actually overcome this challenge. And this might be a bit of a longer term challenge. So see life as a game. So one great way I'm doing this is by, of course, like uh, speaking to girls here and there, you know, that's a great way to actually like build your confidence really fast. But another way I'm doing this is by biking to Austria this, um, this in, in, in two weeks I'm gonna bike to Austria. So this is very, this is a very big challenge for me because I have never drove that far with a bike. My maximum was like 500 kilometers in three days, but this is basically like 2000. So I'm gonna bike every day 200 kilometers just to challenge myself because I know this is gonna be fucking hard. I know this is gonna be really, really hard. And, and I'm basically gonna sleep in on the floor. I didn't even bring a tent. I'm not even, I'm not gonna bring a tent, you know, I'm just gonna sleep on the floor of a forest just to challenge myself. But I know if I overcome this challenge, I will um, build my com confidence, you know, and competence, which one very interesting thing, you know, if you actually wanna build your confidence, especially like around girls and anything like this, you need to accomplish certain things. Too. So the way you're building your confidence is basically by accomplishing like certain things. So for example, accomplishing by uh, accomplishing th things like getting a girl's number, taking her on a date, starting your business, doing things you thought weren't possible before, like biking to Austria and back, things like this. So if you know you're competent in those things, you will actually have more confidence. So yeah, challenge yourself, see life as a game of like, winning points like i get that much points or oh, so when i speak to that girl i get so much points guys comfort is a bad place to be if you are comfortable right now you need to get off your fucking ass that's basically an indicator that you are not progressing that you are not going forward you need to live on your edge and and i mean you need to you need to keep doing things that will challenge your comfort zone because this comfort you know might be the, the reality of so many young guys so many weak men but we as as guys you know on self improvement we actually want to we, we actually want to have a different reality a reality of more success you know more success in business we want to become the top 10% of men, you know, with women and all these things, you know, we do not adhere, adhere to those you know, weak standards, you know, we hold ourselves to bigger standards. So yeah, 
get out of comfort get out of comfort you know stop watching movies <laughs> stop watching stop playing video games actually start your own business because it's gonna bring you so much also happiness competence and confidence so one way to overcome your weakness is by joining the spartan brotherhood so this is basically a private community where we focus on self-improvement and fitness and this is basically my business right now but it isn't online yet so if you're interested you can check out the link in the description i will put in the, the website link and if you're interested just send me an email via via the, the contact form there and you'll be the first one to know if i put this whole thing online spartans prepare for glory